because I was a little geeky and I was you know, getting into stuff. One point I'm doing this and the next point I'm geeking out and doing things like I had an anatomy lab in my dad's garage. And he was like, what, what is all of this? What is going on? And why are these kids in the neighborhood here? I thought I'm just engaging in fun things and I'm following things that light me up. But I realized I was also distracting from things around me that made me feel bad. Growing up in a small town in Virginia, when I did, I was surrounded by examples of anxiety. And I saw highly intelligent people who were suffering. Not a single human gets to come to the planet with zero anxiety ever. So at some point, all will and do experience it. Unfortunately, the state of medicine now, you have provide doctors who are and nurse practitioners and prescribers who are not even communicating. So patients are coming in on wonky combinations of things and things that just don't make sense. So I have a particular patient, came with 10 plus medicines, has seen at least six different specialists. And the question is, what is this? Well, I have to put that piece, that, that story together. I get all of the data and I do the timeline and then I see what happened first and where, where we missed it. Or where, if only a lab, that lab had been checked, or if only they hadn't added that medicine, or only if those providers had communicated, or if only the patient had told the doctor that they were drinking also, or smoking also. So my patient felt somewhat shamed the first time she communicated certain things to her doctor. So she didn't communicate things anymore. She's seeing all these specialists. She's also self-treating. I am going through all of the data and asking questions in a very open way, connecting with heart. I care about you. I want you well. I see you well already. If you tell me what happened, transpired here, this big gap here, and she communicated a trauma. She hadn't communicated, she'd been in therapy for 20 some years. Connecting that way, reviewing all of the data, and then it becoming clear. We're gonna remove this because it's not necessary. The doctors didn't even know this, this, this information. If they had known that, you wouldn't have been at, that wouldn't have been added. So in the course of doing that, one medication she ended up with, there's nothing like that. There's nothing like helping someone get off of 10 medicines. There's nothing like helping someone go from being immobilized and afraid of leaving their home to being out and about and doing what they came to the planet to do. There's nothing like it. <laughs>